So on this one here, we're just going to use the straight uh, standard wedges. This is a piece of cottonwood. And cottonwood generally has, uh, it's a really straight grain uh, piece of wood. It is considered a hard wood. Got some really nice checking going on here all around. This seems to be the deepest check right there. And so this is where I'm going to start. So you got the two different wedges here. They're both standard wedges. It's a little bit wider and a little bit longer, a little bit shorter, a little bit less of a profile. Uh, you would use this one here probably better for starting off on something that maybe doesn't have some checks in there. The lower profile will keep it from bouncing out of the wood. Uh, I'm going to use this one. Let's see what we can do with that. And see the check coming through here and it's definitely coming off up through there but we also if you could see that I don't know if you can but there is some round it's probably going to split yeah you can here it'll probably split out to there We'll get a nice round piece there. Might This one actually might kind of quarter itself out as I'm splitting it, but we'll see. Looks like I'm gonna get a core on that one. This is a pretty wide piece, so it's coming, it's going around the core. You see that right there? And coming back out on the other end and coming through here. I'm gonna run this one over on this side. And uh, there we are, we split that out. Yeah, nice and this works with the nice uh, straight grain wood. Just trying to check out that direction there. Yeah, it's starting to come
Uh, so we'll go grab the other wedge. And that's splitting with a standard wedge. Like I said, all this really straight grain stuff, you can, you can see it. This is really nice and straight, so those wedges would work fine. Uh, just the other ones there, like on that sycamore, where it's all twisted, you're gonna wanna use uh, the wood bombs. Now, a wood bomb would work on this too. It wouldn't have any problems with it. Uh, but for the purposes, I'm just going to show you that if you're going to, if you have straight grain wood, the regular wedge would probably work really well for you as well. Anything with twists, um, you're going to want to use probably the wood bomb. Really the one of the most important things about choosing a wedge is knowing the type of wood that you're going to use that wedge on. Um, so, like if you were doing the sycamore like I would, was that, you, you wouldn't even want to start, you, you couldn't even start with this one here. You'd just be bouncing, you'd just be bouncing this wedge out. You couldn't even get that wedge started. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, have a great day. Uh, like and subscribe. And uh, talk at you later.